first play when I was seven years old. And I'm pretty sure from that point forward, acting was, was what I wanted to do. It was how I learned to process the world around me. It was how I learned to interpret the world around me. I think it's where I found my voice. Uh, I worked on a children's TV show. I did. My parents drove me to every audition within an hour radius of where we lived. I, I was doing college theater by the time I was 11, 12 with the community college there. I started teaching middle schoolers things like improv games and, and different uh, pieces and theater games and things like that. Theater is the ultimate teacher for something like time management. That had an influence on me from an early age because I, I always assumed everything sort of worked that way. But it taught me a lot about being able to prioritize what needs to happen because at the end of the day the curtain is going to go up. There is a firm deadline, patrons have bought tickets, and you need to have a show ready. And that's been a really great tool in a lot of other uh, pieces of my life where I'm able to sort of prioritize what needs to happen and what's the most important piece of that. Theater impacts everyone who experiences it. You know, this pandemic has made such an impact on what it is to be live and to share space with other humans. Um, theater is, is ultimately the telling of, of the human story, of what it is to be human. Seen through history in times that it's, it's faded and, and moved and changed, but it always comes back and it always is a part of, of our history and a part of, of how we identify and discover who we are as human beings.